Hi, Greg. Hi, Hugh. How are you? Very well, thank you. Very well. Thank you for joining us on Film Fiend. First of all, I want to say that, that I'm a big fan of yours. Pretty much everything you do, uh, House especially. I, I loved you in, in Street Kings, the character you played there. It's just, I'm just a big fan. It's an honor to talk to you this morning. Well, thank you very much, sir. Thank you. This, this movie, The Oranges, I got to say, um, I, ju I just was able to finish watching it, and it really takes you on an, an emotional journey throughout the entire thing. Well, I hope so. Uh, it, it was quite a journey to make it, uh, and I hope the audience goes with it as a, as a journey. Um, I, think it's, I think it's funny, but I think it's also touching in its way, and I think it's... Uh, um, it, it treats the characters with with respect and affection. I, it's not it's not sort of uh, judging or sneering at anybody. I think it, it, it's very it's a very forgiving uh, world that it creates. I mean, there's all kinds of upheaval in it, but it's uh, I think it's done in a very humane sort of a way. I hope, anyway. It, it, it was great. I mean, um, there were moments that I was laughing, and then I'm like, well, should I be laughing right now? It's just, it just, it, the ride was just so much fun. And, I mean, the characters in it were, were great. Leighton Meester was in there, and then the, the girl that played your daughter, Ali Aaliyah Shawcat. She was just, she was just wonderful in, in the film, too. It was just a wonderful ensemble cast. She is fantastic. I mean, the story is really told from her point of view, from the point of view of the uh, of Aaliyah's, who plays my daughter, Vanessa. And it's her, it's really her story. It's about her uh, coming of age, really. Uh, but coming of age in the middle of this storm, um, uh, this emotional storm that's going on around her between these two families. And it's, uh, I, I hope it's a, it's a, it is an amazing cast. I was so, uh, I felt so lucky to be, um, playing that part with those characters, with, with those actors. It was uh, just a real treat, real treat. With it being such a heavy storyline in some ways, is there anything that you can actually maybe draw from, or is it just something that you just have to find a way just to get into the character and then just go from there? Well, just, just find a way, I suppose. Find a way to uh, uh, represent a world where these two families uh, have... have have become so entwined in each other's lives. Uh, you're, you're, of course, having to do that with relative strangers, but that's part of the challenge of it, and it's part of the fun of it, in a, in a way. Um, you have to find a sort of common ground and a language and a way of doing things that, uh, that, that makes sense very quickly. Um, but, uh, as I say, there's such an amazing cast that... Uh, that part of it was really, really good fun. I mean, Alison Janney and Oliver Platt and Catherine Keener. I mean, these are really wonderful, wonderful actors. And it was such a such a treat to be doing it with them. We have a question that we like to ask here to, to everyone. And it's just kind of just something. So we get we get just a bunch of different answers, different types of answers. But when you've got some downtime and you're just sitting there and um, maybe you're watching TV and a movie comes on or, or something like that, is there a movie that you can just, doesn't matter what it is, you can just watch it over and over, no matter how many times you've seen it already? I would say that The Big Lebowski, I could start at any point in the movie and think that I'm only going to watch for 10 minutes, but I actually watch the whole thing, and then if it started again, I'd probably watch it again after that. That would probably be my pick. But there are, there are, other, there are other movies I could do that with, but The Big Lebowski is a, pretty, is a surefire. Uh, although I did it with This Is Spinal Tap, um, just the other day, uh, and it's as good as it ever was, if not better. Those are wonderful movies. Big Lebowski is one of my favorites. I can watch it no matter no matter what's going on. I can just listen to it on in another room, oh, no. just have fun with it. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> Hugh, we thank you so much for joining us. Uh, just we encourage everyone to go out and watch the oranges. You were you were wonderful in it. Thank you so much for joining thank us. Thank you on very Film much. Feed. Thank you.